just waiting for Twitch to update. For some reason, I decided I wanted to update. So. Good. Hello everyone, welcome to another episode of Nexamon Extinction. I believe this one is actually episode 10. I've uploaded this episode 6 and 7 to YouTube. I'm about to do the last two episodes. Uh, in the previous episode, we had found the underwater city of Cadium. Uh, took care of another elemental there. Uh, tried to stop um, Amelie and Vados and it didn't work. So we were branded traitors, we were arrested, broke out of prison. And now we're going to see our mentor in Lateria about something. Uh, so basically that's what we're doing next. Um, so yeah, here we go. Um, yeah, last time I swapped all my next one over as well. Keeping these two. Haynook's going to be my standard water one, I think. Um, and then, yeah, we'll just go from there essentially. Uh, I want to see if I... There's someone here that wanted cores, didn't they? I want to see if I've got the right ones. Are they down here, I think? This person. What did they want? I need a vitality core too. That was it, yeah. Okay. Right, so I've got to go to... The hideout, I think? Not the hideout, the... Uh, there's a building over here. As if it's like revealed that it's like, oh, I'm the Latarian chief. And it's like, oh. Uh. Oh, there's that. Oh, okay. I'm in, I'm in the wrong bit. I actually need to go to the big bit in the middle. So I was nearer to it than I already was, so I kind of just ran away from it. Here we go. Oh, mine shards. Yes. So yeah, uh, I'm streaming a little later than usual. Uh, it's currently quarter to two in the morning. I'll probably go for like an hour and a half or so. Um, you know, famous last words. Long, long ago, the King of Monsters, Omnicron himself, tried to overthrow this world with the help of his children. Is he a ghost? <gasps> Victory in our grasp. So weak, so beautiful. The puny humans were at our mercy. Their fate was ours to toy with, and it sure was fun as heck. Am I getting visited by all of them now? What the hell? Oh, how sweet indeed. The age of the Nexamon was about to begin. Along with Father, we would cleanse this world from the human disease at last. Truly, memories to be relish. Anyone else join? Yep. But a traitor among our brethren machinated our, our, machinated our demise. The one with too soft a heart took pity on the lowly mortals. Is, that gonna, is this where it's revealed that it's me? Dina for suckers and did the unfor... Oh, Dina did. Okay. That little girl doomed her for our kind. Oh, that little girl doomed her, our kind. Okay. The absence of a king drove the next modern of the world into madness, which ignited a war among tyrants for millennia to come. Only a true heir from Omnicron's bloodline can bring order and restore the natural balance of our planet. But our king was slain long ago. Omnicron lives no longer. And yet, Omnicron's bloodline lives on. The story goes on. The egg. We did not foresee this, but Dina, the great traitor, had a child. She paired a true heir to Omnicron's infinite power, and that hair is standing before me. Me? What? <laughs> okay. Yes, indeed. Ryan, you are Dina's son. You are Omnicron's descendant. Oh my god! <laughs> okay, that's a twist. 
You are the future king of monsters, our one and true ruler. Cool. Is that egg meant to be me transforming? Interesting. Do I get a recap at the beginning now? Because I completely forgot what happened. Oh, here you go. Fuzzy memories. You sure about this? Hurry up, please. My very presence might attract dragons to this place. Oh, okay, that's why she came out and protected me. This building. This is a human orphanage. Dina, you are leaving your own child, Omnigron's hair, in a place that reeks with the humans. Brian will grow with the humans. He must learn to accept them. The future king of monsters. The supreme Nexamon, rotting in a place like this? And I'm to pretend that he's one of them? Come on. I never allow Ryan to grow vile just like Omnicron. Our father's hatred against humanity would end with Ryan. Okay. And how am I supposed to explain to Ryan about his supernatural powers when they show up? The other kids at the orphanage will surely be terrified. Give him this. <gasps> what? what the heck is this? A tyrant egg? A fake tyrant egg? Oh, for God's sake! <laughs> no! Ah. <laughs> Fine. You will lie to him. Tell Ryan that this his powers are channeled from this object. Good gracious. You can't seriously think that your son is dumb enough. I don't want to read the rest. I guess I am. Still, there is one more problem. When Ryan becomes of age, the dragons will realise that he's a tyrant. They will hunt him down over and over again. I'd like Ryan to join the guild to ensure his safety. Working with humans will make him see what father couldn't understand. And then, one day, Ryan will be strong enough to claim Nondokron's throne. A new king of monsters, who loves both humans and Nexamon, will rise. Oh, for God's sake. So we've been doing that for nothing. We took their elements for nothing. Right, here we go. What's this going to be about? You want me to what? It is essential for Ryan to believe that he's human, Fenrir. You want us to pretend that we... That we are powering up his fake tyrant egg. That's your idiotic plan? I can't afford to have Ryan figure out his true nature too early. If we're not careful, Ryan will grow corrupted by his sheer power, just like Father did. This is stupid, girl. I won't play fool for you. Come on, Fenrir. If you want Father's bloodline to continue, this is my one condition. You guys will play along. This is our last chance to make a difference. This will be your redemption. Oh my god, we've been played the whole time. You! I don't care if you're, you're my mother, technically. You're a bitch! <laughs> that is so hilarious. So, I shall trick Ryan into thinking that Omnicron's air is inside that fake egg, hmm? Oh, you're a bitch too, Eliza. I'm gonna call it something super dumb like Tyrant of Light or whatever. Tee hee! Will you help me, Eliza? Ryan will seek your guidance. I need you to misguide him. Oh my god, that's so messed up. I'd love to see how this develops. I love Ryan go and visit each elemental shrine. Then your siblings will teach him how to control his own powers. Fine. Let the act begin. Oh my god. Just whatever, as the minutes go by, I'm just like, oh you. Why should I trust you now? Oh, it's got achievement. Omnicron's legacy. Uncover your origins and embrace your new self. Do you understand now, Ryan? Amelie did nothing wrong. Her dragons are indeed perfect. The dragon outbreak from 15 years ago was not an accident. It was caused by your own birth. Cool! Now I'm responsible for everything. Dragons aren't insane. They are afraid. They acknowledge you as the strongest of all the tyrants. The true heir to Omnicron. When a dragon attacked you at the woods, we realised that your powers were starting to surface. You were sent on a lame journey to meet us and learn how to control these powers, all under the pretext of hatching a fake tyrant egg. Sooner or later, you'd be strong enough to become the new king of the Nexamon. Yes. Upon your ascension, the tyrants will naturally stop fighting. Peace will finally be restored. But, alas, 
Vados was quite unexpected. That aberration is programmed to hunt tyrants until the end of days, including you, my dear. If you are slain by Vados, then Omnicron's bloodline will truly end. There is no telling what would happen to the natural balance of the world. I kind of just want the world to die now. What the heck's going on? Vados' power from this far away? That creature just keeps getting stronger. Citizens of Harem, this, this is Vados, the ultimate tyrant. Do not fear, my comrades, for Vados is the child of mankind, forged by science and nothing else. Under our control, he will slay every single accursed tyrant that dares stand in our way. His power is limitless, and so is our future. We will cower in fear no more. Please, stand with me and Vados. Together, humans will retake the world. Well, this could be an interesting fight. Well, at least I know what the telescope is for now. Excuse me, young Tamer. Oh, God. Yes. Haven't you heard? It's an emergency. All Tamers in the city must meet at the barracks right now. Ah, there's no time to explain, alright? Just come with me. The observatory is now closed. Oh, oh. They would spit. Cool! Plot twist that just. Ah. Oh. What did you say? It is exactly as I've told you. A tyrant has been spotted to the east. The guild will test the extent of Vados' power against that tyrant. You can sit back and relax. You dare mockers? Were you unable to hunt the tyrant ourselves? This is Lateria. We have slain dozens of tyrants. And the guild appreciates your service. But now, you are obsolete. As a token of our gratitude, I come with a warning. Stand back. We don't know how destructive can Vados be. Surely it'd be... We don't know how destructive Vados can be. Never mind. This is not guild slave. We do not care how powerful your abhorrent Nexomon thing is. This is our turf, and we do as we please. If a tyrant is nearby, we'll take it down, like we always do. Your fancy guild and Vados can get lost. <laughs> of course. Do as you please, General. But please be careful. Shut up, Edward. Get out of my city. There's a tyrant. A tyrant has appeared to the east of the Tyria Desert Fortress. Join the other tamers and hunt it down. I get 400 coins, perfect berry, nature shard, and mine shard. Okay, I'll take that. Oh, what a reveal! Hey, Ryan. Are you gonna help those Tyrian hunters with that tyrant? I heard that there's a good bounty. Oh, come on. Did you listen to Edward? All we have to do is relax and let Vados do his thing. Ugh, whatever. I'm out. Don't count on me. Yeah, I don't really need you anyway, Ross. You know, he's right. Vados may look all scary, but so far he hasn't gone berserk or anything. Oh well, can't hurt to take a look. I also want to see how Vados fights that tyrant. They said that the tyrant was spotted far east of the city. Okay, off we go. Oh god, what a twist. To be honest, didn't see that twist coming. I don't know how I feel about it though. The fact that this whole thing that we've been in story-wise is like, Oh yeah, that thing? Yeah, that's not real. That's literally the worst thing he can do. Oh yeah, that? Pfft, don't worry about it. It's all for nothing. I'll try and cope with it. But maybe, some, maybe something later on will fix it, I guess. We'll, we'll, we'll see. But for now, I'm just all... Why would you do that to me? Oh, I got plenty of Nexomon traps. Wait, what's uh? Aha! All right, I'm gonna give you a worse one then. Actually, to be fair, let's give you a lot more attack power. All right, I'm gonna go back and I'm gonna go finish that other quest off. I'm trying to remember where they were. Were they upstairs? I 
go this way, weren't they? There you are. I oh, don't. Bloody hell! I'm gonna <laughs> just equip the other thing I shouldn't have. Right, have a. Uh... That plus four attack. Oh, I'll tell you, you can have plus eight health. Yeah, there we go. Okay. So, head east out the city. Oh my god, just... I've got the evolved version of it. I got Loom. Not a recommended partner for those who love to hug their Nexamon. Loom's head, paws, and tail are completely engulfed in flames. Look at you! Right, uh Right, I got anti burn. Aha! We haven't jeweled yet. Oh I know you. Yes I do. You are Ryan, the one that saved Anisha. Hmm. I remember watching you go down that elevator. Yes. I used to hunt tyrants in my youth too. Perhaps I could teach you a thing or two. Worth the try there. Oh, of course you would. Oh, I'm so annoyed over that plot twist. <laughs> I'm trying not to be, but I am. Don't really know what that did. Sure. Forty pain up. Right. Oh. Whoa. Did the fight already start? We're not there yet. We gotta hurry up if you wanna see the tyrant. Right, right, I'm coming, coming, coming. I can freeze the water now. Yeah. Oh, I need another vault key for this place. Okay, it's actually just the one room. But still, at least I know. So two vaults I have a place for now. Which is always good. Right, have I fought this guy before? Yeah I have.
Hello. Look at you. How ludicrous. How poignant. The Tyrius Hunters sure don't live up to their name. A sad charade. You poor cretins. Petrum is not the feeble tyrant you are used to hunting. I will to punish you for that disappointing display. I'll take care. Uh, I will take your city. It will take your people. Your coin and your dignity belong to Selene, renegade of sand. Oh yeah. You want a bet? Oh my my. Are those spears? You brought spears to a tyrant fight. Whatever are we gonna do, Petrum? They brought spears. Get them out of my face, Petrum. Ooh, good gracious, Petrum. You are just too strong. I can't remember the last time I actually fought on my own. Th them fighters on your own, blasted renegade. Stop relying on a tyrant like a coward. Nice try, sweetheart. Petrum, plus those fools as well. I need to hurry up. I can take over Lateria, who will serve as a shelter from Vados. I'm here to fight you! And who might you be? You don't look like a Latyrian hut. You're a guild tamer! Bullsar, be praised. This is exactly what I needed. If I could take you hostage, the guild would surely back off. I only wouldn't dare to attack if you're here. <laughs> yeah, about that. Don't take this personally, little one. Oh, never mind. I thought it was going to be, don't take this personally, little one. Did I do that? What? What did you do? Why is Petrum frozen? How? Stay away from me, freak. Oh yeah, you wanna bet? Watch, I'm gonna fight you. Oh, bad move. I do believe fire is super effective. Never mind, it's not. Grass is super effective. Come on, Hainuk. I do a lot of damage as well. You got a lot of health. Bloody hell. Too bad, they are a few levels above me. That's probably why I'm taking so much damage from
bring it up. Lumiere! Lumiere. I keep calling it Lumiere. Aha, you're frozen. Oh, I'm burning now, bollocks. No! Damn it. It's the only one that doesn't get XP. Uh, no, I don't want an energy strike. Am I going to get the triple evolution here? You're not very experienced hunting tyrants, are you? Achievement! Renegade Selene. Do you really think that a little ice can stop a tyrant like Petrum? In the middle of the desert? Do I have to fight you now? What is the matter, boy? Not so tough anymore, are you? You can't just rely on silly tricks and luck, nay. The guild has made you naive and weak. You've wasted your chance to win. A fitting end for Amelie's lapdog. Right, first off. Oh, that burn's gonna do so much damage to you. Oh, you are so screwed. I'm so glad burning worked. Look how much damage it's doing. 50 per turn. Oh yeah, is that not regal? And another evolution. That's five evolutions already. Into it. 
Mr. Grebin. What is the deal with you? Ah. And that strange ice power you have. Where did that come from? You don't happen to have a tyrant as well, do you? What if we do? Fools! How can you be so dumb? Two tyrants? Two tyrants in the same place? Valos will sense our exact location. Idiots! So what? Valos is all the way in the capital city and... It's not. Oh. Yeah... What's the matter, Valos? I can sense two tyrants. Yes, two in the land of sand and stone. Yes, indeed. Tyrant Petrum has been sighted near Lateria. There are no reports of a second tyrant. This is odd. Ah, not good. One of them is overwhelmingly powerful, Emily. Is that so? This second tyrant is very dangerous. I don't like him. Perfect. This is a good chance to show the world that you're on our side. After all, some people are still a little concerned about your existence. I can annihilate them without any problems, I believe. But, what will be of the human hunters? They seem to be fighting nearby. We warned Lateria to stay away from Petrum. It would serve them right to witness the true power of the guild. I will not harm humans, I believe. Of course not. That's not what I meant. Ugh. Just focus, Vados. All we have to do is hit the tyrants directly. Surely you can do that much, yes? I will do my best, I believe. I don't know why I gave him that voice, but that's what he's having. <laughs> Whoa there, what is going on? Petrum, how long have we, do we have before Valos arrives? And dead. Uh, Petrum? Hey, who the heck are you? Shut up, shut up, shut up! Let me think, I need to focus here. Ryan, what are you doing here? Forget it, don't answer me. Ugh, you guys are so hopeless. Stay still, Ryan, just stay still. I demand an explanation, what are you doing? Whoa, what did you just do? What was that for, kid? Answer me. I just saved you from Vados, buffoons. Nonsense, Vados is not even hit. He is. What the heck is that? Petrum! Petrum! This is it. This is the power of Valos, the perfect tyrant. Open your eyes, Ryan. Take a good look at your enemy. One day, you'll face him whether you like it or not. And on that day, the victor will decide the fate of our world. So yeah, no pressure. Understand. I think Petrum's dead. The guilt. Oh, got a message from Xbox. Oh, it's just new stuff at Games Pass. The guild. Amelie. Anos. They are this strong. I, I can't beat this. Nobody can. It's impossible. In Orzar's name? What happened here? Did Vados do this? This is not the power of an Exomon. Vados is something else. He is not of this world. Well, guess I've got face an interdimensional being. I can't believe that we were trying to fight that monster. We were so stupid. Ugh. This is it. I'm done. I'm super done. I'm not challenging the guild. They can do whatever the heck they want. I have to agree with Ross for once. What do you think, Ryan? Are you giving up as well? Ha. <laughs> what? You want to fight Valos anyway? What's with this obsession of yours? We have no reason to fight him. Be him yourself, Ryan. Don't drag me into this mess again. Valos may be horrifically powerful. 
but he hasn't gone out of control. He frightens me too, but he specifically targeted the tyrant, not us. I'm also leaving Ryan. Emily is the master of the Tamer's Guild for a reason. Everything she does is for the sake of Param, isn't it? Sorry, I'm out of this as well. We gotta stop. Please reconsider, Ryan. Are we the ones who tried to strive at us before he even had a chance? It's not right. But you don't understand, I'm a fucking tyrant. But I can't fucking tell you because I'm a mute. Ouch. That hurt to watch. Sorry, kiddo. Ryan, you seem to have odd reasons to oppose the Fados. But I welcome your support either way. What about you, Celine? Are you with us? I guess. Gotta avenge Petrum somehow. Or at least try to. Ryan, you're still a guild member since Edward pardoned you. Try to lie low. We need time to think of a plan how to defeat Vados. Ryan, darling, I don't care what the others say. You're the one who beat Petrum, not Vados. So why don't you go back to this area and claim the bounty? Oh, and next time you meet that psycho magician girl or whatever, thank her for me. Would you like to fast travel? No, I don't. Because there's a guy here that wants to duel. Got it. Guild, such rotten vermin. Look at this destruction. How dare they attack so close to our city? I'm not forgiving any of you disgraceful tamers. You just misunderstood. Oh, come on. Leave me at level 50. Now we've got level 39. Judge looks level 41. Grabbing level 41. Right, I'm gonna head back now. Right, so at least you're taking care of a tyrant already in this episode. Mm, I don't have you. Be nice. Grabbing out. Right. Here you go, have an orange. Yeah. Oh yeah. Its nest is always covered in shiny cocoons waiting to hatch into numerous worms. Worms? Warps? I don't know. You can go to storage. I found three stone shards. Don't really need to deal with you right now. Ocean shard, a mine shard. Wait. 
Ooh. How had you before? Bollocks. Never mind. Ah, there's a warp. Sure, attack me all you want. I'm just gonna capture you. I wish it was like a bonus for how quick you did that. I got me a warp. He's sneaky next time on with poor eyesight. The shiny orb on his back is not in his abdomen, but a jewel that helps crystallize his enemies. Gonna put you in my party instead, Jelly Flux. And then uh, give you the little orby things. It's so nice having these synergy cores. It's like a really good EXP share. I wonder what happens if you have four of them and you're the one dueling. I don't know if you get the experience and then another 100% on top of it. Ah, let's try this again. That's better. Bordeon was caught. Its tiny legs aren't built for running, so it rolls around to move. The little mace on the end of its tail is said to be as tough as diamond. But it's also red. Right, you're also going to hold four of these. There we go. Alright, I've already fought you before. Oh, what's going on? This is pretty much just hinting, go down this way. Right, let's go talk to him. Hello! Right, exactly the person I wanted to see. I heard that you defeated the tyrant before Vados did. This comes to show that we don't need Vados to do our job. Take the bounty, lad. It's yours and yours alone. Thank you. You may look like a guild tamer, but deep down you're a Latyrian hunter. So please, Ryan, take this as well. Yeah! That's a Latyrian sigil. Proof that we acknowledge you as a warrior. It's kind of useless now, though. Thanks to the battle, soon nobody will need to hunt for tyrants. The world without tyrants is nice and all, but I can't believe that some freaky lap monster is stealing our job. Ugh. Sorry, kid. This isn't your problem to deal with. Go and enjoy the city. The Tyrion Sigil will earn you some perks to respect among our people. Thank you! Now I can actually shop on the... the things. If there's two of them, they've got to have some specific things on offer. Oh, hello. Never mind. Sorry about everybody ditching you, Ryan. Don't worry about your friends. The reaction is natural in this situation. I've told that there's everything about your true nature, by the way. Now, listen very carefully, Ryan. This is crucial. <gasps> Reflection. Vados' ultimate goal is, perhaps, noble in nature. To protect mankind, he will never stop until all the tyrants are slain. 
that includes you, the your Omnicron's true heir. It is a cruel fate, but that's just how it is. You must survive, Ryan. You need allies. You need comrades. To face Vados, you'll have to recruit an army. Who's going to help us fight Vados? Nobody dares to face him. The one thing that you once swore to destroy, Ryan. You must recruit other tyrants. Oh, ho, ho, that's going to be cool. What? A tyrant would never want to work with us. Want to. It's not about what they want. They don't have a choice. The tyrants don't work together. Vados will annihilate them one by one. Simple as that. Well, one's already dead, so... They will join you whether they like it or not, Ryan. Hmm. And how are we supposed to find the tyrants before Vados does? Atlas, this is exactly the reason Dina retrieved you. This was her idea. You were originally built with the ability to track tyrants. A radar, so to speak. Remember? Indeed, this has been Dina's plan all along. If Ryan is to become the next king of monsters, then he must first gather his vessels. Does he not? This is your purpose. Help Ryan build his army and ascend to kinghood. I can't believe that we're doing this. To scan the entire service, I'll need a very high altitude. Why not the Drake Isles? Surely you can see everything from there. Lydia can probably help you find a good spot. I believe that she's still around here, in Lateria. Talk to her. I don't know if it's a good idea. Probably not. But Valos will surely come after you sooner or later. So I guess you don't have much of a choice here, eh? Hmm. I feel like I've stood on that, but like, some of the bits where I've walked in and go, oh, nothing's here. And it's like, it's because I've not got there story-wise. Like, I know there's a, there is a perch that you can look over stuff on the Drake Isles. All right, hello. I can actually buy stuff from you now. I know the idea would just be to just buy the perfect berries, but I do like the idea of using these. Right, what are you selling? Oh, you just got the anti crap. Okay. Uh, right, I've got to figure out where Lydia is now. She's probably up here. Observing. Three mine shards, nice. Oh, there she is. Let's go talk to Lydia. Let's go the other way.
how pitiful that situation is. Would you agree, Ryan? Vados' power. I can't even begin to fathom what he's capable of. The other tyrants and the renegades are hiding, but he will find us. I'm sorry, Ryan. What else can we do? We can still win. Win? Oh, Ryan. This isn't about defeating Vados anymore. This is about survival. When Vados ascends to power, what will happen with strangers like you and me? What will happen to this world if he goes mad? How about we recruit the other tyrants? I have a radar for that. I just need a place to set it up. Are you serious? A place to set up a tyrant radar? Well, how about... Excuse me! Oh, hello! Oh, it's you! Hello, fellow, uh... Tamers! Say, I couldn't help but eavesdrop your entire conversation. You have a tyrant radar? Wow! Yes, I do. It must be awfully valuable. Oh, bitch, go away. That's only logical. You could probably fetch a million coins. Pfft, try a billion coins. Oh boy, gotta hide that from thieves. You bet. I'm so like that even a small girl could steal me. Haha. <laughs> oh, crap. We knew where this is going. Have I gotta chase her down now? Yeah! Please say you punched her. She just slipped and fell. Oh, okay, that's funny. That's actually funny compared to actually someone knocking her down. Is that she just slipped? Hey, you okay? Oh, you idiot! Oh, come on! We don't have the time for this. We need Atlas to find the tyrants. Right, we must go after them. Hurry! Can I just take a guess she's gone back to her house? Uh, I swear to God, she is here. Just need to remember which house it was. Was it this one up here? Okay, she's not here. Damn it. I was kind of hopeful there'd be like a... Wait, you followed me back here? Uh, uh, how can I talk to Atlas? I've not got him with me. <laughs> Never mind. Okay, before I do that... Let's get back to the Tyria and let's chase her down. Wait, oh yeah, she jumped down, didn't she? So I've got to. I've actually got to go down and around. idea where that thief could have gone, right? Huh? I just realised that you don't talk much, Ryan. No wonder you always had Coco around. Perhaps some of the locals have seen the thief. We should ask. Uh, I should ask them. Thief? Hmm. Yes, I think there's a woman running to the west. That's all I know. Ah, yeah, I did see a thief just now. She went south. Thief. Oh yeah, I think I saw her walking south. Please, Ryan, mind your step in the ruins ahead. Thief? Well, yes, I may have just seen suspicious of you enter that cave. That makes sense. There's a guide there as well for a side quest. Whistles. Whistles. If you can't even follow them, you have a much easier time. That's the thing. You need a bunch to notice the difference. I don't have time for that. Here, I'll give you mine just a few coins and extra traps. What do you say? Yeah, sure. Phew, I that I managed to sell that garbage whistle thing. Who needs whistles when you can just throw a dozen extra traps? Ha! Here's a point. 
Right, guess we're going in here. This place reeks of tyrant. You sure that the thief is here? She didn't seem like the sort of tamer who'd dare venture into a dungeon this dangerous. Yeah, I'm sure she would have. Have I got the the ether thing? No, I don't. Okay, so I can have random encounters for now. Oh, I, I want to see what pops up. I'll take you. Yes. Right, let's figure out what food you like. Oh yeah, not a starkle. You can power up any psychic type move with the ring on its head and project powerful beings with its forehead ring. It is particularly skilled at creating multiple illusions. Interesting. Well, you can go to storage. Found a stone shard. Do you mind shards? I'll take that. Oh, another thing I don't have. Oh, what a shot! I'm going to try it. Ooh, you're being a little in there, aren't you? Oh! Damn it, after all that. Let's see where this jumps into. Oh, I found a chest. A wind whistle. Nice. Already got one of you. I can do with you. Hey, eat this. I right, got two third chance again in here. I got boo. Nah, uh, you can go to storage now. I feel 
like I've stumbled across something. Okay, that takes me all the way back. Oh, there she is. What? I can't do that. I already told you. But you're a supercomputer. What do you mean you can't mine Bitcoin? I wasn't made for that. I'm just going to sell your time radar then. Oh, no, you know. Oh, snap. Hey, return what I stole. Come and fight me, Rocky. I've already fought you before. Oh, uh, well. I'm going to put that one out. I could put that one out, but you know. Good thing I have some antifreeze. I'm not going through the last time when I was frozen for 10 turns. At least I know what Woozle eventually turns into. Braxton is very evasive and I like that. Uh, I'm just going to bring Lumia out for this one. Lumia does a lot of attack. Ah, it's got fire moves. So do I. Oh, you're dead next turn. I'm so sorry. You look cool. <sighs> that was a close one. Well, John's level 42. Well, level 41. Anix level 42. Claudius level 28. Give me those evolutions. Oh yeah, bulge crane. All right, kid. Now, cup D. Fine, fine. Take your stupid toaster. You told me what you're doing. I don't want anything to do with that. You want to team up with Tyrants? Come on. Do you see the skeleton behind me? That's Grunder. He's the reason there's a giant hole in the state of the city in the desert. Give up, mate. Just let Vados do his job. What do you think will happen when Vados' job is over? Vados will slay the Tyrants. Sure. That's his prime directive. A violent, mindless and soulless machine. Who cares? Tyrants will be gone. No more war. The tyrants will, no, will not be gone. Eh? Valos is not a true Nexamon. Thus he would never be acknowledged as a king of monsters. As such, Omnicron's throne will remain vacant. And tyrants will continue to rise day after day trying to claim it. So what? Valos will slay those tyrants as well? He's super powerful. Of course, he will slay them. And the ones after those too. Day after day, Vados will mercilessly exterminate tyrants in every corner of our planet. Yes. An endless cycle of destruction that will eventually decimate all life in this world of ours. What? And with Vados' relentless determination and power, 
How many more times can this planet endure such brutality? And how long before humans are caught in it? Ryan, this is not where I wanted to give you this, but our time is short. Close your eyes. Oh dear. That's the remainder of my power, Ryan. This is the element of Earth. The time has come to build your army against Vados. The tyrants must unite if this world is to survive. Ryan, take Atlas to the Drakars and use his radar to locate the tyrants before Vados slays them. Achievement, element of Earth. Even if we do find them, it won't be easy to convince them to join us. You can do it, Ryan. This is what makes a true king of monsters. Right, well, first things first. A healthy charm? Oh, I'm, I'm hoping that means it recovers health after each battle. Yeah, okay. I'm guessing the element of Earth lets me move that thing out of the way. Oh no, I can just go under it. Hello, Ryan. I know a decent spot in the Drakars where we can set up Atlas's radar. Would you like to leave this dungeon now? Are we done here? Oh god, I can't accidentally do it again. What? What do you want? It's one of my many hideouts. People are afraid of this big tomb. Good luck with the whole tyrant army thing, I guess. Well, first, I'm going to explore the other side of the tomb. Because I never went on the left side. Alanostra. Alright, give you another tornado kick, I guess. I'm stunned. in the Nexo Trap. Thank you. No to be very to... No to be very... I guess it meant known to be very territorial. It usually stays in the vicinity of the place it is guarding. Oh, you can go to storage. I need to see if that is the last thing it evolves into. Oh, I got rid of Pep Glem, didn't I? I need to get myself another one. Yeah, okay, I don't need that anymore then. Don't need you. Not what I had intended. 
No, 53 for Rexima. Discount voucher. As long as that's the only thing that was there, so. We're finally outside. Let's head to the Drake cars and set up the radar, shall we? Remember, my village? That's where I must go. Oh, I forgot to recover thingy. Frozen. It's no longer frozen. Oh, I'm bound. Great. Ah, you're poisoned. That was probably a bad move. I got a Holoc, which I already have one, but you know.
Yeah, I got a look at my... Oh, if I get myself one more mine shard, I can make five more cores. Right, first to trade in some Nexomon. I think that Zotor evolves into something else. <laughs> Yeah, it does. I need to get me a Zumble at some point. Cake. I could do with the chocolate cake. Uh, where are we going? Trey Kyles. I'll do this part of the story and then I'll I'll wrap it up. I think. Oh hey, Lydia's waiting for us over there. She can show us a good place to set up the tyrant radar. Hurry up, Ryan. I have the perfect spot for Atlas. You'll be able to scan the world below the tyrants without any problems. Guess I'll 
guess we're going that way. Yep, knew it. This is the most appropriate area to set up your radar. From here, we can find all the tyrants before Vados hunts them down. So this is what Dina wanted me to do, huh? Alright, time to scan the world. Ding! Well, what'd you see, Atlas? Hmm. The radar is working. I can see the tyrants. One, two, three, four. There are four tyrants out there. Wonderful. If we can recruit them all, we might actually stand a chance against Vados. Truly, fate seems to be in our favour for once. Any news, Vados? Hmm. <laughs> Why, yes. I've located quite a few tyrants. Is that so? Four. Four tyrants within my grasp. Yes. Four tyrants? That's remarkable, Vados. You can slay them. It'll be a huge step forward for us. Absolutely, Emily. I won't fail you. I'll decimate them at your command. Then... Defeat the tyrants, Vados. Prove to the world that you are on the side of the humanity. Well, let's be quick then. Oh, it's these guys, okay. Hmm. <clears throat> Don't you worry, Mortimer. Once you recover, we will take over Emisha for sure. They will see. We will have our revenge. Huh? What was that? What is going on? What is this power? Well, that's one down. What is this? Mosima! Mosima! Guild has finally revealed the existence of Ados, a super Nexamon they call. No worries though, the old tower is a good shelter, we'll just hide here and... Will there? The sound, where is it coming from? Nivalis! What the heck? Well, we're already down too. Oh, there's the other one. If I'm not mistaken, Vados must be hunting down the turrets at the surface. All according to plan. <laughs> Vados will be weakened from so much effort, he'll be vulnerable. That will be our chance to betray Amelie and take over her guild. Literally nothing can go wrong. You were saying... What? Amelie? I'm surprised that's not flooded underwater. Oh no, Eurus! Oh, this is not good. It's five more minutes. Totally worth it. No way. This is... This is impossible. Atlas. The Tyrants. I'm afraid so. Watch helplessly as Vados eradicates the tyrants. The tyrants are gone. All of them. We lost. We... We lost before we even started. Everything we've done. But nothing. Why? Why is this happening? Ryan. Ryan. Can you hear me, child? Don't give up hope yet, Ryan. There is one more tyrant. You can still win. Watch carefully, Ryan. Open your eyes. Uh, what's happened to my screen? What the hell? The grand capital city of power. Go to the capital city. To the lab. In 
the council city. There's a forbidden pathway to Khan Woods. You must intrude. You must make your way there at any cost. Oh, okay, the bit that I couldn't go to before. What you see is a safe haven that even Valos can see. A shelter from his wickedness. A paradise within a battlefield. You must come here, Ryan. You must come to me. Oh, hello. You're puny compared to the rest of them. The other tyrants may have been slain, but there's still one way to answer my Vados. You must hurry, Ryan. I'm your ally. I am waiting for you. Well! Are you kidding me? The tyrant just talked to you? You want you to come to the capital? It's definitely a trap. Come on. Have you heard of a forest in the middle of the city, Lydia? Huh. Looks like she lost her will to fight. Well, it's not like we've got any other option. Let's go to the capital city. You were pardoned by Edwards and nobody would stop us. Do you, Lydia? Cheerful music, yeah. Okay, guess we're going to power him. Actually, I want to see if uh, I I need a mine shard, so I'm going to see if I can find one, and then once I do, I will then go there. Oh, we haven't jeweled yet. Bye bye, a guild tamer, aren't you? Think that you're worthy of entering Lydia's domain up ahead, but to be fair, I've already been there, so. Frozen now. I'm going back to the, the old fire pit. Ooh, bad move to put a ghost out. Up oh, ten levels. Up oh, thirteen levels. Um, Peltry! It's become Shrombrella!
it's become Udeborg. Oh yeah, I can jump across here now. Give me a mine shard, please. Just want a mine shard. We've definitely fought before. Yeah, mine shot. Swap over the ball out. Um, oh, vault, I think. Yeah, let's go for vault. Going back to Param. Stop up in the lab, make some more of those cores. Huh. So this is what became apparent. Gives me the chills just thinking how close we are to Vados. I did some research and there is a small forest accessible to the northwest side of the city. Let's check it out. Oh, you got a quest. Oh, right. What is it? Do you need something? Khan Woods, huh? Ah, there we go. Ah, oh, it's not a big deal, really. It's a bunch of colourful trees and whatnot, yeah. Well, as long as you're not doing a fishy again, I won't mind letting you in. You're a gold tamer, after all. Ah, oh, thank God I came here. Nice. I came here for one thing. I actually did the quest. Whoops. Must be Vados. He's grown a little impatient trying to find more tyrants to hunt. Don't worry about it, though. Have fun in the woods, Ryan. Well, yes, I have. Yeah. Look at all those synergy cores. I've got 20. I need four more. Ooh, new location. Khan Woods. Oh, look at this place. It's plagued with scientists. Are you really sure that there's a tyrant hiding here? My radar should have picked up something already.
I'm guessing. Alright, fight me. Here, that's right. I just found the secret cave because I'm a ghost. I haven't told anyone about it yet. Oh, you let me stay quiet? Well, back in my day, we decided everything with the next one battle. So let's roll. Oh, you've got grass types. That is a shame. Oh, I do so much damage, I love it. Oh yeah, vaults evolving. It's a volnamic. Whoa, it's been centuries since I had such a good fight. Alright, alright, buddy. I won't tell these boring scientists about this cave, I promise. Finding nature shards. Wish illusion ush. They're dead, that's what it is. Ah, oh, I guess this is where the earth thing comes in. Doesn't seem like the scientists have got this deep into the woods. Whatever lies beyond this cave must have been disturbed for a really long time. Maybe you're right about a tyrant hiding here. Why can't battle sense this place? Boom! Biscuit, this outside is away. Must be a mechanism to operate the gate somewhere nearby. I guess I gotta drop down. Uh, what are they? Are they Raxons? Oh, okay. Oh, they're quite powerful ones, bloody hell.
I forgot to heal myself. uses its four senses to search for food and stay away of enemies. The extension at the tip of its leaf is used to listen to its surroundings. Oh, there's a chest. Cosmic Charm! Already got one. There we go. Huh. Looks like something happened outside. Should we leave now? found a lost village, I think. Welcome, welcome, welcome. This hidden village, this sacred haven, this ancient home. Lord Takala waiting, Lord Takala waiting for you. Huh, I suppose this Takala guy is a tyrant who summoned us. These people don't seem to be affiliated with the guild. Something about this village keeps it concealed from Vados' eyes. We should be safe around it. Oh, beam me up, Coco. Activate every warp stone. Oh. Oh, never mind. I thought it was a place I can walk behind. Right, guess we're going up. I'll finish off whatever this bit is here, and then we'll do the next lot tomorrow. Ah, Ryan, yes? Son of Nara, foretold heir to the King of Monsters. You honour me with your royal presence. You're the tyrant that called for us? Yes, indeed. I'm on your side, see? I am, as your mother once put it, a backup plan. She feared that Vados would obliterate all the tyrants before you could recruit them. Sure enough, he did. I owe my life to Dina, who hid me in this wonderful haven. Now I shall repay my debt by fighting alongside her son, Ryan. So what is this backup plan about? Mm hmm. It is a risky move, but we have no choice. Dean has designed a desperate plan that must be executed to perfection if we want a single chance to relegate Vados. Help! Help! Giltamers! Giltamers found village! Our village! Found! It must have been the builder that we destroyed on the way here. They're probably particular tamers though. They know where a tyrant lives here. Vados was attacked already. Right, you must help me. They find me. The backup plan will be lost. I need to remain hidden. The guild realizes we are helping a tyrant. We'll be back in prison. We've got to restrain those invaders no matter what. Now, Terry, uh, we'll, we'll do the fights and then I'll wrap it up.
take out a Yomnum, I need one. Minus goggles. What do they do? With this item, all boulders will take less time to respawn. Oh! Can I equip that? Okay, it's just regular. That's pretty good. I guess it must have been left. Ooh, I'll take you. Why is an ancient Nexamon that lives in tall grass and near rivers? It is rumored to transform into trees in order to go unnoticed. Achievement! Own 150 Nexamon. Psychic powers are efficient at preventing bad dreams, making this a popular next month to keep around the house and in hotels. Well, you can go to storage for now. If I actually took the thing or not. Ooh, Rufus. Look at you. Like a weird seahorse thing. You're weak as hell, though. There we go. 
An extremely fast underwater Nexomon, most of its attacks benefit from its slippery leaf shaped fins and from the air pressure generated from micro bubbles in its skin. Yeah, so essentially it's a seahorse. Guess we're going left. Oh, God damn it. Poison cloud. Don't really use it. I don't think it's this way. I think it might have been down, but I just maybe I just didn't go far enough. Like maybe I have to go back to the entrance. Okay, so the girl found the way to Vegas. You can't let them to get find them up in those tamers before it's too late. Oh, they're in the village. So maybe the to the right. Ah, <laughs> uh, this is what I've got, but I'm leveling up right now. Oh, there's a there's a path to the left. Didn't see it. Dragon whistle. It's a dragon the according to the air type. So I'm trying to figure out. There we go. There's nothing valley around here. Maybe I'll check the other side of the village. Huh? Who are you? Oh, you're a gold tamer. So cool. You're here to loot this village as well? Heh. <laughs> Great tamer, take a light. Me and my partner have just been trying to find a way around that boulder. Today it just a bit. There's value here though. Check somewhere else, shall we? I'm not here to check. Hey, uh... What's your problem, buddy? You're not with them, are you?
Ooh, goblet. Should they say here, uh, anagram for goblet? Well, at least I know what Skunk Cute evolves into. Chuckly! Just because I do quite a bit of damage, that's why I'm just sticking with this one. Go on, hey, up. No. no, no, bollocks! Forgot about that. Yep. Yeah. Crap. Right, hey, no. XP Hmm. He dangerous. No leaf. No leaf. We take to Chicala. Lord Chicala is a side face. Yes. Didn't that guy mention coming here with a partner? He must be nearby. Let's look around. I I really hate when the music just disappears like that. I found a Mara companion. Yay! That looks like it's going to be useful somehow. Alright, their companion must have gone on the other side, I guess. Yeah. There we go. Surrounded. I gotta bail out. I gotta run. Ow. Oh. Oh. oh, you're a guild tamer. I'm saved. Come on, you gotta help me out. Help me return to the capital. The guild needs to know something strange to have going on here. What? You won't let me go? You're a traitor? Time to fight. Ah, oh, perfect amount. Bad idea bringing a ghost out. Bad idea bringing a grass type out. Oh, you're screwed either way. Come. 
Sobert XP! Sobert XP! Where's all this ruckus? It's you! Goodness, sure has been a while. Hello again, Atlas. Please, bring the intruder inside. I'll take care of things. Ahem. Hello, Ryan. My name is Hilda. In a time long past, I fought alongside Atlas and other heroes against the original King of Monsters, Omnicron himself, your grandfather. Why is your spirit here? I thought you'd be in the Immortal Citadel. I left that place under the care of my apprentice. I was hoping that she'd be sufficient to assist Ryan. Unfortunately, the birth of Valos was unforeseen. There was no telling what awaits in our future anymore. The least I can do is use my power to keep this place concealed in Valos's eyes, as you've noticed. Now then. Backup plan, was it? It's risky, but now that Valos has annihilated Tyrants, we have no other choice. What is the plan? We can bring them back. We can revive the fallen Tyrants. What? We don't have a res resurrection machine anymore. Oh, we do. We have a Rexham Rexham machine. His name is Ryan. Oh, what? <laughs> Come on! <laughs> Ryan, Nara was the ancient tyrant of life, and you are her son. Thus, you have inherited her power to manipulate life itself. I got the element of life! You can bring back the tyrants, every single one of them. An invincible and immortal army will rise at your command, Ryan. Sweet! This is your backup plan? If we revive the tyrants, Vados will simply attack again. Correct. Time is of the essence. It's all or nothing now. There is no guarantee that the tyrants will join us in the first place. Desperate times call for desperate measures, Atlas. Takala used his powers to freeze the souls of the tyrant. Ask him. He will reveal the locations to you, Ryan. We might raise an army of tyrants overnight. But Vados will definitely realise that something is going on. You cannot defeat Vados on your own. This is the only path for us. Go speak to Takala. He will explain the rest of the plan to you. Also, here's a little something we'll in the village. Yay! Now, go, darling. Your ascension awaits. It was nice seeing you again. Great, so not only am I the grandfather of the king, I'm now also got the power to bring them back to life. I'm missing one there. The green one. The green one is me. Right. Let's go heal up. Um, talk to whoever. And then I'll wrap it up there. Might be the final episode tomorrow. If this is going as planned. Maybe. I don't know. Hello, I've come to talk. Oh, hello. You're in here now. Ah, right. I trust that Hilda has explained the plan to you? The idea of restoring those monsters is not thrilling in the slightest. But you must do it, Ryan. You must plead to your old foes and rise together against Vados. <gasps> Ooh! These are the special warp stones that lead to the location of each soul. You must visit them in earnest, bring them back to our world, and convince them to fight for you. With Nara's power flowing in your veins, you will certainly succeed. Who placed them? It was me. I placed them as instructed. Coco? What? What is this twist? Who is this guy again? Oh right, you're the one who ditched us in the desert. Well, I made up for it by placing these stupid warp stones. Carl explained everything to me, so I decided to help you revive the tyrants, right? Well done, Coco. This will save us plenty of time. Thanks to these warp stones, the guild won't be able to track Ryan's movements. How splendid! Raising an undead army of tyrants. This is gonna be crazy. Ryan, my child, start by picking any warp stone that interests you. Souls are trapped in something that looks akin to the abnormal tree. Don't worry, you'll see what I mean. 
Once you have brought back all the tyrants, we may rethink our strategy to finally defeat Vados. May Ulzar light your path, son of Nara. Tutorial. You have awakened Nara's power of life. You can now revive the fallen tyrants. Five side quests, one for each tyrant, have been added to your journal. Complete them to progress the story. Hey Ryan, remember that the guild isn't aware of this, so you can still visit the capital like nothing happened. Sweet. Okay, well, this is where I'm going to wrap it up. Jesus, what a few twists in this one. Um, so, uh, yeah, we're basically going to go revive the tyrants. We are the grandfather of the of Omnicron, daughter of Nera, who is a green one that was helping us in the first place. So we are essentially the tyrant of life. Um, yeah, that egg was meaningless, but at least we know sort of why we have it, I guess. But uh, yeah, this is pretty much where I'm going to wrap it up. Next episode might be the last one, depending on how much is left of this. It will be grabbing these five, and I'm guessing the final battle with Vados. Um, YouTube, Twitter, Instagram, Xbox slash PlayStation. They're all Arbillington94, all capital letters. Twitch.tv forward slash Arbillington if you've been watching it on Twitch. Um, you're already there, obviously. Uh, but if you watch this on YouTube, go to Twitch because that's where I'll be streaming it. I'll be back tomorrow around 1am, sort of similar usual times. Um, yeah, well maybe i'll be finishing it off i don't know but uh thank you for watching this um do go over to youtube to watch the other episodes if you need to catch up um and yeah i will see you in the next one All right bye